Hey guys, I was asked to pick a match. Uh, and this particular match you're about to see, this particular match that I picked. I uh, I can't remember ever watching this match back. The, the only memory that I really have uh, of this match up until now um, is I got the crap beat out of me at the end. Uh, and I remember fighting all over the building, which to my knowledge, from what I remember, was not ever supposed to happen. <laughs> um, but yeah, this one should be interesting. I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm gonna watch it for the first time with you guys. So uh, enjoy. A clothesline over the top rope and out to the floor goes Homicide. He and Lethal battling as Samoa Joe. Lethal shoots off low key. Clothesline takes low key off his feet in a second. Making a third, and low key wants to go to the floor, but Lethal puts on the race. Samoa Joe with a reversal, and Homicide takes the steal. Keith fires Lethal out to the floor. He's able to hang on to the apron. Drives his shoulder into the midsection of low key. Again, Homicide takes the steal. Springboard drop kick from Jay Lethal. The action is hot and heavy here in the opening minute of the matchup. Lethal looking to take a chance, but no. Loki getting that elbow right to Jay Lethal as he went to go soaring through the ropes. Big headbutt from Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe, the pure wrestling champ. There'll be no pure wrestling here. These four guys hate each other. Pitches Homicide back inside the ring. Referee Jason Harding has his hands full with this one. And Homicide begging for mercy. And Loki just blindsiding Samoa Joe. And now both Loki and Homicide going to work on Samoa Joe. Homicide able to take Joe's attention away for just a split second, allowing Loki to connect from behind. Double clothesline takes the big man off his feet. Of course, this match signed after what took place last night in Dayton. It was a singles matchup between Jay Lethal and Low Key. Homicide hitting the ring after the matchup, and they double teamed him until it was Matt Hardy making the save. Tonight, Jay Lethal and his mentor in many ways, Samoa Joe, forming a team once again. This matchup, a rematch of sorts from that impromptu main event tag team match at Manhattan Mayhem back on May the 7th. Key with a cover after that double suplex, only able to get a one count. You said Matt Hardy made the save last night for Jay Lethal. Lethal returning the favor in the matchup between Hardy and Homicide, allowing Matt Hardy to get the win. As Low Key connects with a drop kick to the back of the head of Samoa Joe, hooks the leg, only a two count. Of course, the first meeting between these two teams at Manhattan Mayhem came to a conclusion with one of the most vicious maneuvers in ROH history, the cop killer double stop combination on Jay Lethal, put him on the sidelines doing severe damage to his neck. But ever since, he has been fighting. They tried to break that kid's neck, but the tenacity instilled in him by his mentor Samoa Joe willed him back before he probably should have been back and he is here to try and take revenge on the Rottweiler. He's here to try to finally get a pinfall victory or a submission victory against Loki or Homicide. Plant Samoa Joe with the DDT does Homicide as the Rottweilers are in control. Loki just stepping across the throw to Samoa Joe. Homicide has the ref distracted. Jay Lethal there doing a little more harm than good as he's trying to come to his partner's aid, but just allowing Loki to do damage behind the referee's back. Letting his emotions get the best of him. Of course, Lethal has been close to victories uh, against both Loki and Homicide, against Key at Death Before Dishonor 3, and a very heated matchup against Homicide at Escape from New York, where Lethal bled for the first time in his career during a wrestling match. Hard chop to the chest of Joe. What history between these two, going back to the first Glory by Honor, where Samoa Joe made his ROH debut against Loki. And we got Glory by Honor 4 coming up during the month of September. It shows just how, how long these two have had a rivalry in Ring of Honor. This is a feud between guys that goes back a long way. And like I said earlier, they absolutely hate each other. Chopping away at the chest of Joe, but not backing down. European uppercut, and Key staying on his feet. 
Fires a kick, may have been a little low. Could have caught the inside of the five, but it might have been low there. Pulling Joe into his own corner as the notorious 187 tags himself in. Hard right hand to the rib cage of Samoa Joe. Homicide now going to work. Hard chop to the chest. Homicide and Samoa Joe, no stranger to one another in our OH competition. Belly to belly over the head release, suplex from Joe. A maneuver that Homicide likes to put to use. Jay Lethal tags in and fires a right hand in the corner. Sends Homicide off. Tries to go up and over. Lethal puts on the brakes and nails him with a close on. One step ahead. Oh, high back drop from Lethal. Cover here. Nice flurry by Lethal right there. Needs to stay on the man. Keep it coming. Back heel kick. Connects. Right on the chin. Again, calling for the ref for the cover. Not hooking the leg on that cover. And Loki with a quick shot to the eyes of Jay Lethal. Trying to put a stop to what he had. Homicide up to his feet first. Snap bears him over. Drives the boot to the back. Fun face lock, maybe looking for a suplex here. Trying to block the attempt, Jay Lethal again blocks. Right hand to the midsection, a homicide by Lethal. Chopping away at the chats. And going to the eyes of Lethal, getting very frustrated. He's trying his best to just out-wrestle the Rottweilers, but they keep taking shortcuts. They go to the eyes and it's, it's infuriating Lethal but there's nothing he can do about it. Now two handfuls of hair and just taking him over by the hair. And in comes Key once again. Again, he's got Lethal by the hair here. Just yanking him up and driving him to the canvas by the hair. Cover here by Key. Moa Joe in trying to break up the count. And now it's the Rottweilers pitching Lethal out to the floor to do more damage. Referee tied up with Samoa Joe as Homicide drops the elbow off the apron and down to the floor. Homicide joining with the fans in the front row here. Big right hand dots the eye of Jay Lethal. Against the barricade, chop right across the chest. Listen to the impact of those blows from Homicide on the outside. Covered by low key. Two count again, Lethal able to get his shoulder up. Of course, the match last night in Dayton between Key and Lethal uh, went to a no contest as they let their hatred and their, their uh, attitudes get the best of themselves in the midst of the matchup, put their hands on the referee, utilized the referee to their advantage, uh, took the action to the floor and into the bleachers. Referee tried to reason with them to bring it back inside the ring. And it just came down to the fact the referee had to throw the match out because they got a little bit too aggressive, and it turned into more of a fight than a wrestling match. Yeah, he had lost all control of that match. They were all over the building in Dayton. A little more control here. Homicide driving the knee into the midsection of Jay Lethal. Now putting the bad mouth, trying to draw Samoa Joe into the ring, and he did just that. Oh, Samoa Joe wants wants at the Rottweilers, and he's got they've got Jay Lethal cut off from the side of the ring that Samoa Joe can make that tag. He wants in that ring. Just think of the wars between Joe and the Rottweilers, like the slap exchange with Key at the second anniversary show. Absolutely brutal, the wars between these four men. Homicide taking over on Jay Lethal here. He said they got him cut off from his corner, isolating him and going to work. Lethal trying to struggle his way to his feet, drives the elbow to the midsection. Homicide able to plant the knee to the stomach. Beats him to the punch, drives the knee into the no, midsection again, no, keeping him away from Samoa Joe, and, and Joe stepping through the ropes. He wants in there. Homicide while is just baiting him into the ring. I mean, who could ever forget when Homicide threw that fireball in the face of Samoa Joe at Reborn Stage 1 in Minnesota? There's so much history between these four men. Nothing Key and Homicide won't do to try and put these guys out of this business. Tried to break the neck of Lethal, tried to blind Samoa Joe with a fireball. And just a stare down between Joe and Key. I and mean, who could ever forget Key's return at Reborn Completion? We throw him across the back, Lethal spitting in the face of Samoa Joe. Referee trying to keep him out of the ring as the Rottweilers double teaming Jay Lethal. Bulldog off the 
his shoulders are low key. That's got to be it right there. No, Joe in to break it up. And now it's homicide and Samoa Joe staring each other down. Again, putting his hands on the referee. They better be careful. In danger of getting this match thrown out as well. And Loki applying the body scissors on the midsection of Jay Lethal. He's in a great deal of pain in this hole. Needs to make that tag, get Joe the legal man in the ring. Also has that one arm trapped in there. You see Lethal finally struggling to get that hand free. See if he can make his way to the ropes and force a break. Homicide though slapping the hand of Lethal away as he tried to make it to the ropes. Lethal again going to the ropes and Homicide slapping the hand away. Enabling low key to break things up. Oh, so he's, Joe. he's seen enough. He needs to put a stop to this. He was, he was almost able to reach the ropes and Homicide just slapping away at the hand. Come on. He rolls to the corner, no tag. The referee didn't see it. They made the switch anyway. Homicide's got Lethal off. Wild driver! He just spiked Jay Lethal on that bad neck. I don't blame Samoa Joe for getting involved without making the tag just yet. With the, with the tactics of the Rottweilers put to use, it's completely justified in my opinion. As now they're double teaming Lethal. Just bowling him over with a double shoulder tap. And again, trying to just lure Samoa Joe into the ring to tie up the referee once again. Key with the cover. Two count, Lethal kicks out. Again, Homicide taunting Joe in the corner. Look at him pacing on the apron. Just chomping at the bit, dying to get his hands on either one of these guys. Oh, what a chop from Loki. Just about caved the chest of Jay Lethal in. Places him up top. Hung up in the tree wall. Hanging on to the hair all the while. He's trying to punish Jay Lethal here. And Loki likes to put that double stop to use from this position. But he does a sit up, gets out of harm's way. Can Jay Lethal capitalize? He does! But can he make the tag? He needs to make the tag. Referee applies the double count. Both men are down. Lethal is close to his corner. He just has to roll over. Samoa Joe is right there. Look at him trying to make the tag. Loki makes the tag. Samoa Joe's in. Up and over goes Homicide. And Loki as well. Samoa Joe, a house of fire here. There's Homicide up on the shoulders. Kicks away Key, Death Valley driver. Two and three quarters. Powerball. Gets two, turns it right into the step over toe with the face lock. The STF, right in the center of the ring. Low key climbing the top, Homicide is nowhere to go. Double stomp to the back, breaks the hole. Homicide was finished right there, but Low Key came to his aid. Soaring all the way to the center of the ring, connecting with the double stop, as now Lethal tagged back in. Lethal did not have much time on the outside to recover. Will tonight finally be the night that Jay Lethal scores a pitfall on Homicide or Low Key? He's doing his best here in Chicago. Chop at the chest of Homicide. Reversal by Homicide, Key catches him in the back, Ace Crusher! <laughs> Lethal kicks out, you gotta admire the heart of this kid. Homicide looking to follow up, coming down across the back. Lethal struggles up to his feet, Homicide with a waist lock, go behind by Lethal. Dragon back, suplex. Dragon suplex. Oh. No. That blow from Homicide! That was a warning from the official. Right into the power slam from Samoa Joe. Shoved Jay Lethal out of the way and nailed Homicide with the power slam. And Lethal looking to climb up top. Could be looking for that headbutt. And he gets it. But Cover that man. Cover him. Hooks the leg. No. He gets his shoulder off. Joe going for the leg kick and winds up connecting with the barricade as Loki was able
able to move out of the way. He also got that chair up and connecting with the back of Joe. And Zagiri inside the ring from Homicide on lethal. He tags himself in. Samoa Joe on the floor. Jay Lethal's gonna have to go it alone for a bit here. Hard chop from Key. Make it a second. Kobashi like series of chops across the chest of Jay Lethal. Sends him off the ropes, ducks down. Sets a little too early. Sunset flip by Lethal. Double stop! He kicked out! He kicked out! He can't believe it! Jay Lethal staying in this matchup! Joe struggling to try and get to the apron. Lethal has got to make the tag, though. Low key, very focused, backs Jay Lethal into the corner. Yeah. Oh. Follows him into the corner with a clothesline. Rolls him down to the canvas, Key going up top. Lethal staying on his back inside the ring. Big elbow off the top. Cover. Lethal kicks out once again. Oh, he just kicked the ref in the face. Again, it doesn't really matter if there's a referee in the ring between these two men. They just want at each other. It's not about a wrestling match for them. We saw that last night in the singles match between Key and Lethal. We're seeing it right here in this tag team match. Homicide again, knocking Joe to the floor. Lethal's trying to fight back. Double axe handle to the top of the head of Samoa Joe as Lethal fights his way back, trying to make his way to the corner. But there's no Samoa Joe to tag, even if he can make it there. Homicide biting away on Samoa Joe's head as Lethal chops away at the chest of Loki. Rosa by Key. Throw first into the second rope, he goes. Double stop! Jay Lethal draped across the middle rope. Low key connects with the double stop. Throws across for the cover, he might have it. Able to get his foot on the ropes. Meanwhile, Homicide and Samoa Joe still battling. They take the action out to the floor. Joe is not going to make it in time to break up that cover, but somehow Lethal able to make it to the ropes. On the side of the second turnbuckle with Samoa Joe. Thumb to the eye. Looking for that DDT. The attempt thwarted by Joe. Running drop kick in the corner from Loki. Lethal back up, looking for the Dragon Suplex. Dragon, he gets it. Cover. Homicide just up with the wild oh, 